sharp knife, good fillet in knife. Down behind this fin here. Then I like to put a slice down towards the front of the fish from the back of the fit, fin, like that. And then I like to run the knife all the way down the backbone of the fish. Just like that, towards your hand, so you've got to be really careful. Then, then that knife all the way down the fish. Keeping the point of the knife facing down towards the actual backbone itself. And push it out through the bottom, keeping the knife down tight. Now running the knife up the side of the bone of the fish. You can most probably hear it. It's just along the side of the bone of the fish, leaving no meat, so nothing is wasted. Nice and neat, keeping everything as tight to the side of the bones as you possibly can. As I say, don't want to waste anything. You get as much meat as you possibly can. Nice and neat, just like that. And there we have a lovely big fillet of pollock. And as you can see, tight to the bone, no waste. Lovely fillet of fish. And then I'll do exactly the same on the other side. So it's just a matter of turning it over. Again, now this piece of the fish here is dead thin. It has got a bit of meat on it, but it's not as tasty and it's not as big. So what I try to do with this, so I tend to take that off, cut that off there, like that. And you've got that nice little piece there. It's got a nice bit of meat on it. Again on the other side, you've got that. Now this is, you know, wasting as little fish as you possibly can because uh, it's the same as, you know, to dispatch a fish and not get the full use of it. So I then cut that off there. Gives you this bit. Now you can eat this. It's, you know, it's, it's nice, but it's just not, it's not as fleshy as your fillets. So what I do with these, now you might think I'm crazy, but what I do with them is I will freeze them down and they make cracking little baits. <laughs> so, you know, it's not a waste. 
everything gets used as much as I can. There's nothing to waste on that fish. That's just the absolute skeleton of the fish. So now ready to cut into sections, ready for the oven. So there's six of us eating tonight. So we're going to go for six nice chunky sections. One. Um, kids having some, so they'll have smaller sections. My little one, if you can hear him in the background, making a little bit of noise. Um, that's a nice big section. And now he's got my headlamp. That's kids for you, isn't it? So, that's a nice big section. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six sections. A couple of smaller sections for the kids. Teddy, do you mind, mate? Thank you. <laughs> He's only 18 months. Bless him. So, we've got six sections. Obviously, that's my section there. A nice, chunky, big section. And then a couple of sections. A little one for the little lad. And a couple for the adults. And a couple more for the other children. So everybody's going to have some nice tea tonight. So now all being cut into fillets, dried tidily. Um, always dry them before putting them in the oven. And then placed on foil on a baking tray. I think we're going to need another baking tray. Uh, 